Good morning, cultists. Welcome back to another unbalanced breakfast with Cthulhu's. Let's continue as the Jewish Khazarians in our attempt to stomp out everything that is not Jewish or Khazarian. Actually, anything that's not both. So even if you're uh, Jewish, if you're not Khazarian, I'll stomp you out. If you're, eh, maybe not actually. If you're not Jewish, we'll stomp you out. But semantics aside, let's uh, let's continue on. Uh, last episode, we had a lot of uh, people uprising and um, just being jerks because, or for whatever reason, I don't quite know. But we're also in the process of pillaging a crap ton of these lands, and once we um, once you do actually pillage all this stuff, our clans will surely want more land and all that. So, it'll be interesting. Can we build... Yeah, so we can build a new holding in places, which might not be the worst idea. It should increase our moral authority, I believe. Not that we really need to currently, because... Um, well, basically, to proselytize anything as a um, nomadic tribe, we just destroy all their holdings, and they immediately convert over to, um, to our religion. Simply because there's no one living there to uh, believe anything else besides our own, um, our own religion. So we have trade post- have we actually increased our trade post limit? Can I in fact build more? Uh, not yet. We still have our limit. Let's then... Horse breeder, maybe? Uh, increase their defensive. Let's go with something that increases our... Um, population increase, or whatever. Um, let's go with... Oof. Actually, yeah, let's go with the felt crafter. The nomad text it does sound a little good, so I don't know. It's guess we'll see if I made the right choice or not. All right, so let's continue and uh, try to pillage more as we do this. And our horses are eating more rubble. Let's uh, use people's corpses to fertilize our fields and all that. The Jadertim feud. Khan Kisa of Jabdertim and his people have hunted on our lands, stolen our sheep, and kidnapped our women. This even though they know very well the boundaries between... What? That may sentence makes no sense. They truly are despicable and would betray us instantly if given the chance. Okay. Um, we are going to get you to... Either settle the feud, no. We're gonna get you to split your clan, as a matter of fact. And then we're going to absorb your crap. And then, yeah, we're gonna kill you. So that's how this is gonna play out, just so you know. Yep, you're going to revolt against me, against me which is just peachy. Let's get... Okay, why won't you guys agree? And we just killed someone right off the bat. Fantastic. Okay, someone's joining factions and all that crap. Not cool, guys. Not cool. Let's follow you down to Belgorod. And we have another clan that's feuding with us. What the shit, guys? We have a new daughter. Fantastic. And that revolt is over. Cool. That was uh, super easy. We're gonna absorb your traitorous clan. Do you guys see what happens if you try to start shit with me? This is what happens. I hope you are entertained. Uh, let's go with um, town infrastructure. Oh wait, was that not the technology that uh, the game was telling me to um, improve? Okay, well that's that's fine. Whatever. Let's do it anyways, and then we will go with um, morale of armies is pretty good. Then again, siege would be nice too. Not that we 
currently do a ton of sieging, but let's go with cavalry. Yeah, I think that's the safest choice. And we have clans wanting more lands, obviously. Hmm. Okay, so what I'm actually going to try this time is... See if I can actually give away... Uh... Like an entire duchy and see what happens. Because you want the duchy of Crimea, so you, you actually don't matter. Okay, never mind. Yeah, let's actually just give all this land uh, in Sarkel to another clan and just kind of have them consolidated over here because it's not it's not too bad. It's fine. Let's go with uh, Sergov or yeah, Sergov as the as the thingy. That's it. Great, and you can also have my friend. You can have. Sarkel. No, you can't have Sarkel because I need a couple of new advisors. Um, they don't like me for whatever reason. We'll just get, get people who will like me as my advisors. And yeah, there we go. I have great support. Fantastic. I would have given it to um, someone who, you know, um, would it was like a powerful vassal. But the only powerful vassals I currently have are just couple of um, really not so powerful people and this guy I, I want to take a shed away from him anyway so it doesn't really matter in the end who is Orthodox Uprising if you guys can take care of that that'll be absolutely just peachy but in the meantime let's give you Sarkel jeez if I can just find it here holy crap let's give you uh Way too much crap. We'll give you... Shark... Sharokan, I believe. Sorry, kill. Does that include... Tana? It does not include Tana. Uh... We can actually... We have to make it first. So if that's the case, why don't I actually just destroy these um, titles? I know they'll hate me for it. That's fine. We'll just be like, ah, he destroyed my title. You're a jerk. You'll hate me for 10 years. That's that's fine. I don't actually want duchy titles, as a matter of fact. So I need 200 prestige. Okay, I can't do that. Great. Absolutely fantastic. Um, As long as their clan sentiment towards me is decent, I think we should be okay. But it is currently not decent, so we're just going to have to... Keep giving away more crap to people. You have a tribe there. We're pillage that crap. It's unacceptable. We can't have tribes, guys. We agreed to this. Just can't have tribes. Let's give Lower Dawn to someone. Um, I don't know if I want to create a new... Uh, what's it? Tribe, though. So let's just give it to... S these guys. Oh, man, there's... So much crap to go through. I just can't deal with it. Okay, you took Lord Dawn, didn't you? Why do you still have five? Weird. Guess I thought you had more. Okay, uh, let's give you some stuff as well. Lukamori. We'll give you Lukamori. Yes. And let's give you, my friend, Lord Nip Nipir or something. If I can just find it, there we go. Let's give away Chortitza and Olvia, I think. Yeah, let's give you Chortitza. Chortitza. No, not that's not it. That's not it. Do not click. There we go. Chortitza. And oops. I don't know why I keep doing that. My bad. Who has the feud with me? I don't know. Olvia. Let's give you Olvia. Where is Olvia? There's gotta be an easier way for this. We still need to give away two more lands. 
Otherwise, I'll be pissed. For eternity. I don't have a lot of prestige, so they don't like me because of that. Okay, that's fair enough. If you guys can just wait a little bit, we can... Yeah, actually, I can give away this one. Nysos. No, that's... Yeah, that's Nysos. I was just reading that the other way around. Oops. <laughs> uh, since you don't have a lot of... um. Pop don't have a big population. Well, I give you nice sauce as well, which I'm hoping will not come back to bite me in the ass. Hoping there's not a lot of uh, ass biting in this game, but we shall see, won't we? And we'll also give you Torky. Uh, whoever has the lowest population next will take Torky. You will twerk in Torky. I believe that's where twerking originated from. It was what the villagers used to do in order to ward off the evil spirits that live up their butts. And so twerking would dislodge the evil spirits from their butts. And uh, that's where twerking comes from. Now you know. I'm like G.I. Joe, you know, spreading the knowledge. Because knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe. Uh, during my last few days, during the last few days, my wife has not been able to keep any drink or food down. It seems as if she's suffering from food poisoning. Let's uh, hope that she recovers. And she has not. She has died from food poisoning. What a jerk. Seriously, lady. Seriously. We have some quick women, though. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's maybe go with that. As a matter of fact... Who aren't... who can be in prison, actually. Who aren't married, who aren't rulers. Any religion, any culture, they are yes adult and... Can be of any great house. Let's see if we can find any genius women. Uh, not in our realm. Okay. Genius. Uh, we have... You from... A Germanic lady. See if we can arrange marriage with you. And you will not, because your liege is a jerk, and I can't... I guess I can't bribe him? That's a shame. It's a real shame. Let's go with uh, you, courtier in the papacy. May we marry her, please? Oh, we, we can! That's fantastic. Let's do it. Oh shit, she's homosexual. Damn it, that it decreases our fertility chance. She does have great stats though, not gonna lie. Not as great as uh, this lady over here, but... Eh. Out of... Oh, whoa, it actually gives you a little icon to show you if they're out of diplomatic range. That's really cool. Did I make a mistake? Getting this lady as my wife? Possibly? She has good stats though, right? Okay, so she's not as amazing as these two up here, but eh, whatever. Yeah, she is... She's not the worst. Th that's That's gotta be said. She's definitely not the worst. So let's actually um, see if we can... She's also homosexual, so that'll decrease our fertility chance. She's got a badass scar going through her face though. Can we, in fact, buy a favor from you? You, we cannot. You will not accept any kind of money from us. Can we actually buy a favor from you now? We still can't. Okay, great. That was a waste of money. Um, can we take you as a concubine? You will not. We will try to buy a favor from you when we can't. So let's bribe you. And then, okay, we still can't. I'm an idiot. I am an idiot. I clearly don't know what I'm doing. Let's get this... Uh, lady? To maybe? Uh. Okay, can we buy a favor from you now? No, still? Okay, I'm a threat, apparently. Okay, well, at least we have a genius wife, and that's to be celebrated. And our... Clans want more land because I guess we finished sieging or pillaging some land or another. 
which is fair enough. What land can we give? Because uh, you need, I need to give away one more. Vidin, that's already given away. If only we could just pillage that again, like really soon. That would just be great. Who's sieging me down? Why? Tangri Uprising, really? Because I have like no foothold in my land. Arrange betrothal. Your half sister. Or so the heir to my half sister. This would create a non aggression pact, I believe. With these guys? What the hell? And what is France doing in uh, Northern Africa? No, you guys are. That's not strategic at all. But let's not do that. I'm actually gonna start naming some of my uh, children uh, after. Not subscribers, because. Uh, Again, as I kind of mentioned in my Stellaris playthrough, um, I want to respect people's privacies and whatnot, so I don't want to necessarily just assume that just because you're a subscriber, you want your name plastered all over my games. But I'm actually going to... Uh, get Kasogia. But I'm actually going to um, name it after people who have left uh, comments on my um, videos, because at least there, I know that you're not too concerned about privacy, otherwise you would not have commented, my assumption. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. And I do apologize if I don't get to your name immediately. Um, I'll do my best. Let's pillage that holding, fantastic. We have a bastard son. We will denounce this child. Because the mother is someone who is not important to me whatsoever. And we have... We have something to give away, don't we? I swear, I thought we just pillaged something entirely. And we were like, yeah, we can... Give this away now. It wasn't lukewarm, was it? No. It was something with like a tribal holding. I swear, it existed. Am I losing it? Probably. Let's fertilize the fields with dead bodies. Always a good choice. I swear we could like get a new marketing thing going. You know, um, fertilizers made from the made from our dead enemies. It's fantastic. Fans want more lands. Of course they do. They always want more lands. And I know there's been a little bit of concern about playing as a nomad. Um, that's not going to be the case forever. Um, I am planning on eventually settling down. Let's let's not go for something strategic. Let's go for something that makes my land look a little nicer. So let's go for a cert and uh, call in our allies. Someone has become an intricate web weaver. The Prince of Bulgaria. Don't care. In fact... Yeah. We will execute you for shit and giggles. And I lose diligent. Great. Anyways, so yeah, we're, I'm not planning on playing as a nomad forever. Um, just until I guess I... Kind of capture... Jerusalem and... Basically destroy most of the world. Someone has uh, risen up against me. We have more rubble with which to feed our horses. Let's get our um, vassals to fight that rebellion. We've killed a um, commander. Fantastic. That's the shit. I don't know why I keep um, skipping through all this crap. Weird. Alright. So the that clan likes me a little better. Fantastic. We have infidel scum rising up against us. Always cool. Let's do some more sieging. And let's go down to Bulgar. And we have more people joining factions and crap. 
This is fantastic. More orthodox infidels. Very cool. A dangerous faction coming up. Even though this guy just absolutely loves me, he has, uh, I guess he owes the other guy a favor. And we are wounded. Not good. Not good at all. So let's actually avoid combat for the time being. Yeah, might be a good idea. Come on. Ease that down. Win that battle. And we're good. That's it. Cert is now ours, which is just peachy. It's a kind of crappy piece of land, so we can just give it away. Let's give it to you, who has the, who's the least populous. And just one more county to give away, I guess. Ah, that rebellion is taking some of my crap. And our horses will like it there, and we will... Yeah, let's get some extra prestige. More prestige. Fantastic. Wow, yeah, we're just... closing all this crap down. Fantastic. Can we revoke your title yet? We can not. Because people are being jerks and owing each other favors. someone wants to arrange a marriage, we will not. We will not accept. It's stupid. Okay! Uh, shit! We are under attack by the Byzantines. Um... What do they want? You guys want... Mosia. Actually, you know what? You can take Mosia for all I honestly care. Um... Can we actually fight them, though? That's the question. That's a real question. Hmm. Holy War for Mosia. We might actually be able to fight them off. It's it's possible. It's I don't know if it's likely, but it's possible. But let's get more um, troops, just in case. So we should have 2,000 more troops coming in. Let's, uh, let's actually gather in somewhere where there's a lot of um, supply limit. So yeah, that place is good. Okay, so the Byzantines have a rather large death stack. Um, I'm hoping my allies are smart enough to realize that, uh, hey, maybe we should wait for the other guys to get here before we start shit? But of course, they might not be, so there's that. Yeah, we might actually be able to take them on. This could be very interesting, and uh, just in the middle of that, we have another Orthodox Uprising. Just great. Perfect timing from these guys, and suddenly we are maimed! Great, we have lost an eye. We lost personal combat, and... <laughs> personal combat skill, rather. Guys, come on! Why were you attacking them? Seriously, guys, just... Don't torture people in the middle of a fight. And we have become a brilliant strategist, which is good, but we're still... I believe we're still, um... somewhat wounded, so we need to kind of watch out for that. What happened? Did my troop count just suddenly go down? What's happening? I feel like my troop count just suddenly just... halved. Uh... Hakuna Matata has, uh... become brave, I guess. Cool. Don't really care. Siege all that down. Fantastic. Are we still sieging something? Why? Okay. Um, I'm kind of thoroughly confused as to what's happening here. Hey guys, uh, we don't really care about the minor clan uprising right now. 
I mean, because, yeah, the minor clan decides to take some shit. That's that's fine, actually. We'll be crossing water if I go over there. If we can seriously just consolidate, get your friend. Tarkan has sent you a gift. It is a small puppy, but of the finest pedigree and destined to grow into a great hunting dog. Let's accept it. We will name him Hunter. As I mentioned, I all name all my dogs Hunter. We are improving clan sentiment. Fantastic. And they are about to go into battle. Let's... Yeah, let's go over this side. Okay, what is happening here? Jesus. Here comes the minor clan uprising. It's always fun. Actually, let's, um... Yeah, if you guys can help me with the minor clan uprising as well, that'd be just peachy. If we could please attack these guys and not dick around with me. Guys, no? Seriously, you're not going to? What the shit? Where are you guys going? Thankfully, we are no longer severely injured. But we may still very... We may still be severely injured because we are... Facing a minor clan uprising that I didn't even notice. That's fine. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay, so if I actually... Give in to your crap... What'll happen? Will anything happen? Okay, no, I'll be crossing a major river there. So let's not do that. I might actually be caught my pants down. I am caught with my pants down. We have in reinforcements coming in, but will they get in too late? They got in too late. Shit. Damn it. Can we at least win this stupid Byzantine war? Get the shit over with. Seriously, guys. And if you could seriously just consolidate, I know, you know, you're worried about supply limit and all of that crap, but seriously, if we could just consolidate our forces. Okay, why don't you just run with your tail tucked between your legs? We could, but then we'd also, if we hold on to this, we can actually get, um, piety and, uh, money. Which should be lovely. I guess someone I don't care about is wanting to get a new toy from me? I don't know. What the hell he's trying to exploit from me? Not exploit, I mean extort. What the hell is happening? Chase him down. Because they will be at zero morale, probably. No, they're not. That's fine, we'll just chase him down anyways. Let's, where are you guys going? You're going down there, I believe. To Philippopolis. Very cool. We'll actually siege this down. Just to kind of like, get back at them, you know. Let's pillage that village. Oh, okay, so they're actually fighting the um, minor clan uprising, which is good. Really good for us. And that's it! We won the uh, Byzantine Holy War! Holy crap! We did, I didn't think we could do it, but holy shit, there we are. Absolutely fantastic. Now we just need to deal with this uh, minor clan uprising. They are being jerks. Okay, I don't care about you. Can you not? be educated by me anymore? Can I just imprison you? No, that's heretical. Yeah, go to my court here. I don't care, right? You don't interest me in the slightest, little kid. Which is a good thing. I don't, I'm not interested in children, guys, okay? Just put it out there. In case it wasn't completely obvious. Actually, they'll be crossing a river crossing penalty, so let's get, um, let's get me in the center. That guy in the side, and actually, I want to see if I can get um, somewhat better uh, commanders. 
You have 19, which is fantastic. You have 19 as well, but you're my steward. But, it's okay. It will still accept you. So let's get uh, the guy with 19 on the side. Should be good. I'll be crossing a river crossing penalty. Um, so that should help out in terms of our, yeah, strategy there. Ah, oh, awesome. Did we just demolish them? We did. Guys, this was incredible. Holy crap. Wow, this was, uh, <laughs> what a, what a great episode. Wow, he sounded really whiny. Okay, wife, are you trying to kill me? Can you not, please? Why are you so angry at me? Because I'm an unfaithful lecher. Fair enough, I, and I do apologize for that. I did, however, denounce the child that I had with her. So, I don't know if that counts at all for anything. Probably not. I don't think she's happy with me still. That's okay. That's okay. Let's go with, um... Population growth, I think. That's 3% uh, population growth, that should be awesome. Okay, I think we just have a couple more um, places to... Siege down. Non oh, nomads, okay, cool. Alright, just a couple more places to um, pillage, and I think we're... We're good. Yeah, I think that's... Pretty much it. We do have a fair bit of land to give away though, so let's uh, let's do that. And then after that, uh, um, we'll end the episode. We'll give it to you. You can take Doros, Dora, uh, Scrotum. We'll give you the Scrotum land. Uh, okay. And what else is crap? Okay, so Carnvuna and. Tier Novo, I believe. Or decent lands to give away. Carnuva, Carnuva, Carnuva. Where is Carnuva? There we go. And Tier Novo. Tier Novo? Tier Novo. There we go. Cool. That was a quick find. Anything else? Because they just need to give away one more and then I'm good. Does this actually count towards my holding, though? I wonder? Because I actually try to give away Constantina, maybe? I don't know, though, because... Okay, yeah, their... Yeah, their income is shit, so maybe not. Hmm... Yeah, I, I do need to see if this actually works, so let's give... Um... Let's give you, again, my least populous clan. Constantia. And yeah, it actually does count towards my, um... Clan land domain. Land demand. Okay, that's interesting. Huh, okay. Whoa, they have a hospital? Dang. Even we can't build, build a hospital. Alright, well, leave it off here and come back again in the next episode. This was an awesome episode. Well, uh, at least I think so, but, um, yeah, feel free to let me know how, how you guys felt about it. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and, uh, have a good breakfast.